welcome to Hash Design. Today I thought I'd do a little video on what's in my bag. So yeah, here's my bag here. And let's see what's in my bag. Now this bag I got um, online actually. It's the Campbell, Campbell Satchel Company from the UK. Yay! And it is neon orange. I get compliments about this all the time. But yeah, that's my bag just in case you're interested. It holds quite a lot actually, so I usually take this one to work. I've emptied it and put all the contents on this table, so now I'm going to show you what's in my bag and what is essential for your life in Japan. First off, the most important thing would be a wallet. Now this is an old wallet, but it's done me well and it's a Vivian Westwood one and I love it to pieces. I got it five years ago from my boyfriend, six years ago, six years ago from my boyfriend. It is falling apart now but I cannot bear to give it up and get something else. It's a Vivian Westwood one, I would never buy brand stuff, but I love Vivian Westwood, so yeah. This is in my bag all the time. If I don't have that, I will probably get arrested because in Japan, if you're a foreigner, you're supposed to have a residence card. So if you don't have this, you could get into trouble. So make sure you have that with you. Next, what's in my bag is my schedule. I need my schedule anywhere I go. I need my schedule, I write everything down, I have everything in this book, there's my schedule. If I don't have my schedule, I don't know what's going on in the world. Um, next in my bag is my sunglasses. Yeah, I got these recently for my birthday, so yeah. Sunglasses, it is so bright and shiny outside that I need sunglasses. If I don't wear sunglasses, I just end up crying everywhere because the sun is so bright. Another thing is in my bag is my fan. Um, <laughs> It's so hot today, it's so hot in summer here, I suggest carrying about a fan of some sort. And this is a free one that I got at the cinema. Look, I'm already sweating buckets. This is Japanese summer, welcome. But um, yeah, I got this free at the sun cinema, it's an Avengers one, and yeah, I take it everywhere with me. I'm just going to continue fanning myself with this. Another thing that you'll need in summer for Japan is a sweat towel. And this also happened to be a birthday present. But yeah, you'll need that to wipe your sweat off of you, yeah, I feel disgusting. Everyone in Japan has these, if you don't have one of these you're missing out. A sweat towel is required, but yeah, sweat towel. Another thing I always have in my bag is a UV protection spray, factor 50, because it is so hot outside, it is so, it, the sun just burns. You need a factor 50, everybody needs to put on some protection here, even Japanese people. A lot of people don't actually, but yeah, factor 50 spray. Uh, another thing in my bag is lip balm, yeah, Japanese brand of the cheapest brand of lip balm I can get. If I don't have this, my lips will go dry and they are very painful. Um, another thing I have in my bag is just this Harris Tweed pouch full of girly things like lipstick and makeup and things like that that I would need at work. Yeah, they're in this nice Harris Tweed, tweed pouch thing that I got as a present from someone. I get a lot of presents from people like this. I don't buy things like these myself, they're too expensive, I can't afford them. But yeah, take that everywhere with me. Another thing uh, I always take with me is a selection of sketchbooks. Um, this is my to-do list. This is my randomly let's put things on a piece of paper list book thing. This is my field notes that I got from my friend Wes. Hey Wes! Yeah, field notes are great. Um, this is my life, life goals that I have in here. I carry my life goals with me everywhere. It's a bit sad, but you need something to visualise it. Fine play. My moleskin, or moleskine, I don't know how to pronounce it, somebody tell me. Full of just random work recently. And then I have my life plan, or rather, what I actually need to do with my life and what I'm doing and where I'm going in the world book. I plan everything. It's a bit sad, but I plan everything. I just need to. Another thing I have in my bag, oh god it's so hot, is tissues. You get past these out everywhere you go here, so I always have tissues and it, I'm glad I do because I sometimes need them more than often. My phone! Yes, I live with my phone beside me constantly. If I didn't have my phone, I wouldn't be able to do anything here. I need my phone. It's an iPhone, by the way, which is actually not that expensive here, but yeah, if you're bringing your iPhone from abroad here, you need to check out the carriers and stuff. Um, this is my chopsticks and my spoon set. You will be given chopsticks everywhere that you go and they're the throwaway kind and it is so not economically good so I carry about my own chopsticks. They're pink. This is also a present. I would have picked orange but I got pink ones. I carry these about my bag. Another thing I would not live without is my portable charger for my phone. 
because I've had this thing for about three, four years now and it dies constantly so I need this to charge it with. So that'll give me the one day charge, one day of charge, about an, a, a charge. I also need my iPhone lightning cable and my earphones to listen to on the train because I have to travel an hour every day. Wait, two hours every day, to and back from work, so I need that to listen to. Tra talking about travelling to and from work, my pass, my not my bus pass, my train pass, I would not be able to get to work without that. There's so much cheaper to get here if you live far away from your workplace and I need this every day. So it's my train pass and it comes with this little nifty holder that I got free with a magazine. Yay! I also have a watch because if my iPhone dies I will not know the time so I need a watch. I have a random eraser, I don't know why, I don't know where my pencil case is, I think I've lost it, and my pen, it's one of those pens that you can um, write and then rub out straight away, because I always mess up my address. Next thing I have is some perfume, my mum got me this years ago and I still have it, I should probably get another one. And I got this from a co-worker as a birthday present, and it's a mirror, yay! And the only reason I carry this about in my bag is because it is so sweaty outside that if I put any makeup on, um, I might want to check it when I get to work because if I put any eyeliner on, it will just drip down my face. It's really bad. And another essential at work would be my PC glasses. These glasses keep my eyes safe from blue right light and stuff like that and I have a nifty little case. I got these from work my boss bought them for everybody um, so that we can protect our eyes when we're working. They're apparently they cut out the blue light from the screens and they keep your eyes healthy. And I've been on the computer all day and I forgot to put them on. So I feel like a fool. But yeah, that's basically what's in my bag. This looks like a very small bag, but it's not. It can fill lots of stuff. Oh, there's another thing in my bag. A hair tie. It is so hot here. I think I would die without one of these as well. But um, yeah, that's my bag and that's usually what I have in my bag. I am not one to carry things lightly. I'm not a light packer. I carry everything that I need when I can. Um, I would bring along my laptop and my, my iPad but they're banned in work and actually we're not allowed to take any of mobile phones either. So I can't take any of that sort of stuff to work but that's generally what's in my bag. If you have any questions please let me know downstairs. Please subscribe and give me a little thumbs up. See you!